Okay, we're back aboard the Normandy, and we'll check back in with Liara later, see how she is adjusting to her new job. But, uh, first, I want to take care of um, some unfinished business. I want to talk to my crew, see if anybody wants to talk to me about anything, and I want to go back to Ilium and pick up uh, those other people we were supposed to recruit before we got kind of sidetracked with all the Shadow Broker stuff. I bumped into Zaid recently. Quite the character. Given how much violence and destruction that man's seen, he's surprisingly well-adjusted. Still, I wouldn't want to be alone with him. Anyway, what's up? Yeah, Zaid is... Hmm. He can be unpleasant. Is there anything I should know? Morden would like to speak with you over in his tech lab. Anything else, Commander? That'll be all. I'll be here if you need anything. Commander, <clears throat> Morden requests to see you. Okay, okay, I'll go see Morden. But my little fishies uh, are the number one priority. Here's the space hamster. How you doing, little guy? I'm not sure how um, clearly he came through with the video, but he made a little squeak after he, you know, ran around a bit. Uh, okay. Yeah, so everybody's got this, these uh, personal, this personal their own personal business that they want us to take care of and now we are apparently going to find out what Morden needs to do. Shepard, important news. No, you're busy. Have to deal with the collectors. Planning attack. Too important to wait. Just receiving data. Still processing, analyzing likely scenarios. Not sure how to begin. Too much intel. You remember our talk? My work on genophage modification? You stopped the Krogan adaptation to the genophage. Part of a team. Scientists, all different types. Blood pack mercenaries captured former team member. Malin, last seen on Tuchanka, might torture him, make an example. Recovering Malin would be a personal favor to me. Do you think they found out your team updated the genophage? Unclear. No way to determine until we get to Tuchanka. We'll go to Tuchanka and see if we can find your team member. Appreciate it. My assistant, my student, want to see him safe. Malin last seen outside Erdnot territory. Scouts might have seen Blood Pack. Talk to them or Clan Chief. Outside Erdnot territory. Now that's interesting because Rex from the first game, his full name is Erdnot Rex. Erdnot is his clan. So who knows? We might just bump into him because we've been seeing old familiar faces. Okay, yeah, if I talk to Jacob, he'll just want to talk to, say, you know, hey, uh, when are we going to check out that distress call I told you about that, you know, comes from the ship that my father was on when he disappeared. I want to, so if you want to get that done. Um, if I go to engineering, there's Grunt and Zaid down there. I think Grunt probably doesn't have anything new to say. Zaid might. Jack is down at the very bottom of the place, and she's gonna, you know, she wants to blow up the facility where, um, where she was raised and uh, conditioned by Cerberus to become the killing machine that she is. So she'll just say, you know, hey, when are we gonna do that? Shepard. Just checking in, making sure you're acclimatizing. Humans talk too much, like the tank. That's all for now, Shepard. All right. So Grunt doesn't want to do anything. When he does, Kelly will tell us, I guess, because she told us about everybody else. Thinking about past missions. Got a minute? You might learn something. One time we were trying to clear out this gun nest outside a base on Vatar. Nothing we did even made a dent in that thing. 
Someone had the bright idea to kidnap a local girl, strap grenades on her, and make her go seduce the guy in the bunker. Terrible thing, I tell you. Well, she went up there, knocked on the door, and nothing. Grenades never went off. But the guy stopped shooting, and we snuck by. Never found out what happened. Yeah, well, that's lovely. You smoke, Shepard? Don't. That stuff will kill you. Your kid once. Weapons dealer. Probably half your age. Bastard smoked too close to a cache of explosives. Tossed a butt, blew himself sky high. Yeah. I should let you go. Talk more later, Shepard. And let's do our part to keep the Normandy clean. Let's see if uh, Gabby and Ken... Oh, Tally as well. I forgot she was here now. Gabby, you'd say the Normandy is a she, not a he, right? Of course. The Normandy's the sweetest girl there is. And Edie's a she. Tally's definitely a she. What are you getting at, Kenneth? I'm just saying I'm feeling a wee bit threatened here. A lot of female energy, and I'm just one man. You're such a dick. See? Look where your mind went. I've got to watch out for myself. I love these guys. <laughs> huh. Shepard, what can I do for you? Can you do anything to give the Normandy an edge over a collector ship? Definitely. With the right supplies, I can fortify our shields. The collectors cut through the Normandy's barriers immediately last time. My upgrades might give us a better chance. Okay, yeah, we can get that. Shepard, what can I do for you? Can you do anything to give the Normandy an edge over a collector ship? My shield fortification will help, but I don't think there is much more I can do. How's the Normandy running? Say what you will about Cerberus. They know how to build ships. The Normandy's running even better than before. I don't know if it can stand up to a collector attack, though. I'm researching some ideas that might help. Is the new Normandy giving you any trouble? Please, Shepard. I'm a quarian. Give me a chunk of scrap metal, a circuit board, and some element zero, and I'll have it making precision jumps. I was worried about working with Cerberus engineers, but they know what they're doing, and they've been very polite. Have you got time to talk? I really need to clean up this engine. Maybe later? I'll let you work. Talk to you later. I am guessing Kasumi will just say the same stuff as before, but she might not. Hey, got a minute? Depends. You have anything new to say? Liara Tassoni's got quite a reputation. I've done business with her people before. I hear you and she were an item before. I bet it was hard running into her again after all this time. Oh, okay. We haven't heard this before. And yeah, it was... It wasn't everything we hoped for, but it was fun. As much fun as, you know, that kind of uh, stuff can be. I have to say, that Jacob, mm -hmm. he seems pretty intense. I wonder if he likes Japanese girls with a pension for kleptomania. Joker and Edie are like an old married okay, couple. Okay, yeah, this is all... She's expecting to walk in on them bickering about the temperature in the cockpit. That is all old stuff. And Miranda has uh, stuff she wants us to do on Ilian, like her sister's in trouble. She wants us to do something about that. We're going to go back to Ilian soon. Karis may have something to say. He probably won't, but I'm going to check anyway. Shepard, need me for something? Have you got a minute? Calibrations, right? Can it wait for a bit? I'm in the middle of some calibrations. Uh -huh. Talk to you later, Garrus. I'll be here if you need me.
the importance of calibrations cannot be overstated. Um, pro let's see. Any new messages? Oh, um, yeah. That is... We already read that, you know. It's saying, hey, we got some intel on the Shadow Broker. Liara might be interested in it. And that's what got us where we are now. Um... Is there a mass relay anywhere around here? Okay, there. So there's the check, um... Back to Ilium. So we'll grab a tally for this and. And um, we had Grunt with us before, but I'm kind of tired of hearing Grunt's uh, combat dialogue over and over. So we'll take somebody else. Um, yeah, 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 why not? I'll take Miranda. Um, okay. D yeah. Sure, why not? All right. Ilium is the gateway to the Traverse, but is that gate open too wide? Investment think tanks are noting concerns that new technological discoveries may upset the market balance and cost skilled workers their jobs. Later today, we'll hear from survey teams talking about the latest technology you won't be able to live without and how much it will cost. You have to give the Asari credit. Ilium is a cultural marvel. Humanity can learn a lot from their ingenuity. <laughs> 